Hello again. My name is Corey Sangsteak. I'm a design engineer here at Sheldon Manufacturing. Today, I'm going to be introducing the Shell Lab SCO40 Large Capacity CO2 Incubator. This product features a spacious 40 cubic foot interior, accurate CO2 monitoring and adjustment, as well as precise, stable, and uniform temperature control. This product is ideal for applications, including cell culture, microbiology, and research labs. Let's take a look inside the unit. The first thing you will see is the glass viewing window. This allows you to take a look inside the chamber without actually opening it. Next, the first thing you will see within is the circulation fan. This, coupled with the louvered back panel, provide uh, incredibly stable and uniform temperature control. Also located at the top is the convenience outlet. This allows you to power any devices that you want to have within the chamber while it's in operation. Moving on, we have the shelf mounting points. These allow you to mount up to six included shelves with your unit. Additionally, at the bottom are the tracks for the rolling stand. This is an accessory available for purchase. For information, please see your user manual or our website. Last, you will notice that the interior is constructed out of corrosion resistant materials to help increase the longevity of your unit. Let's take a look at the left side of the unit. The first thing that you will notice in the upper left corner is the main power inlet. This is where you connect the power cord included in your ship kit. Um, one thing to note is that these units must be connected to a properly grounded power supply. For information uh, related to further electrical safety as well as installation instructions, including clearances, please visit your user manual. Located to the right is an externally located fuse drawer. Uh, this allows the user to replace the fuses easily without having to disassemble the unit. Moving on, we have the data logging and gas inlet panel. Uh, first, you will notice three analog data log ports uh, for CO2, temperature, and alarm status. You also have an additional USB digital data logging port should you want to use it. Moving below, we have the two gas ports. First, the CO2 in, this is where you connect your CO2 gas supply, and the CO2 sample port, which will allow you to monitor and verify the CO2 level within your chamber, as well as perform calibration functions. Last, you have a one and three quarters inch access port, should you want to pass anything into the chamber. Now, let's get the unit plugged in and powered on. The main power switch is located on the far left of the control panel. Hitting it enables the control panel functions. First, you'll see the digital temperature display. This is where the user will be able to monitor, calibrate, and maintain their temperature set point. Similarly, we have the CO2 display. This will allow the user to monitor, set, and maintain their CO2 set point. Both of these functions have an active uh, indicator light. Uh, when it's on, the unit is either heating or injecting CO2. Last, you have the over temperature dial. This is a safety feature uh, that allows the user to set a high limit of their temperature uh, to prevent overheating of their sample. Now, let's get the unit plugged in and powered on. The power switch is located on the far left of the control panel right here. The first thing you will notice is the digital temperature display. This allows the user to monitor the current temperature within the chamber as well as adjust their set point and calibrate. Similarly, you will see the CO2 temperature display. Uh, just like the temperature display, this will allow the user to uh, monitor their current CO2 level as well as adjust the set point and calibrate. Last, you will find the over temperature limiter. This is a safety feature that allows the user to prevent overheating of their unit. The versatility of the Shell Lab SCO40 large capacity CO2 incubator makes it ideal for a wide range of applications. In cell culture labs, it provides a controlled environment for the culture of mammalian cells, crucial for medical research and pharmaceutical development. Microbiology labs benefit from its precise control features, fostering the growth of bacteria, fungi, and micro other microorganisms for study. Beyond these, 
Research labs across various disciplines rely on the SCL40 for experiments requiring stable environmental conditions, making it an indispensable tool for scientific discovery.